Okay, we move to party politics. Three weeks after the disputed Anambra State APC Congress, the All Progressive Congress has conducted another process to elect its executives in the state. Over a thousand delegates from the 21 local government areas assembled in Oka, the state capital, to elect their leaders. At the end of the exercise, Mr. Obiora Igwedibia emerged as the APC state chairman in Anambra State. The Secretary of the Congress Committee, Dr. Aminu Ahmed, said the National Working Committee had declared the earlier Congress inconclusive owing to breaches of the party's Congress guidelines. Party supporters, members and officials assemble around the Women Development Center, venue of the State Congress of the Anambra All Progressives Congress. It's a repeat of the party's Congress to elect state executives following the dispute that trailed the one held earlier, leading the National Working Committee to declare it inconclusive. There were people who went to bank as per the guidelines uh, issued out by the party to go and pay, you know, money which will make them eligible to contest for a position. They made the payments, but they were not allowed to participate in the process. The visible security presence is evident to prevent any breakdown of law and order. <laughs> Delegates and officials are ushered into the Congress venue, according to their local governments, under strict police supervision. NBC! Party leaders also arrive amid applause. This Congress will be guided by the guidelines from our national headquarters. Following accreditation and final checks, it's off to the business of the day, and only the position of chairman is up for grabs, the rest being unopposed. We have never witnessed any political party that have conducted a very transparent Congress like this. You can see the way it's been done. The INEX are fully represented. The security men are fully represented. Everything is very transparent. If this is where Nigeria should conduct an election, then there won't be any problem. Considering the circumstances leading to the conduct of the Congress, does the party leadership expect any further divisions? Well, a lot of people have come from different legacy parties. They still feel that they can carry on that way. But APC being a party that want to entrench internal democracy, that is what is happening today in Anambra State. The process continues into nightfall, and eventually the results are announced. It is my singular honor and privilege to declare Barista Obler Igwe Dibia as the owner, the winner, the new state chairman of APC. I, as the state chairman, cannot do it alone. You cannot do it alone as well. The police is also here. They cannot do it alone. The IMF, you cannot do it alone. SSS, you cannot do it alone. All hands must be on deck in order for us to have a befitting standard in our Anambra politics. Anambra APC officially has a state executive, but the doubts about their election can be laid to rest if there are no more disputes from the conflicting interests.